Dally Pierce at the ranch guys. Here we are on a beautiful winter morning once again and another little tip. This little tip, basically I'm going to admit to you I made a mistake. I didn't really make a mistake, but I could have done it better. And I'm going to share with you that could have made it better. <laughs> so you, you can use this. Anyway, we use a lot of ladders here at the ranch. We have several ladders. I have a, I have a 32 foot ladder. Uh, which we use pretty regularly and a couple of 16 and the 20. Anyway, we use a lot of ladders, extension ladders. They're, they're invaluable. You guys know, if you live in the country and certainly if you live on a farm or a ranch, you have lots of ladders around. How do you store your ladders? Well, I didn't want to store them inside. Inside space is too valuable. That's for machinery and tools and stuff like that. I want to store the ladders outside. Uh, it's no problem. Most people just <clears throat> lean them up against a barn somewhere or they lay them on the ground, which is a big mistake or something. I wanted to store the ladder so they'd be easily accessible and protected. Go to your local Home Depot or hardware or wherever and get shelf brackets, ordinary shelf brackets. You can see one in there now, see? It's just an ordinary cheap shelf bracket. They're a couple, three bucks a piece. Like get the big ones, okay? They're usually nine inches on the wall and 12 inches out. Something like that. Get the biggest one you can and then screw them to the wall. One at each, not at the end. You know, space it out maybe a third of the way in. Sounds simple, hey? So what's the big deal? Well, it works really, really well. You can take the ladder. I'll show you here, Kev. Take the ladder off easily. Even an old guy like me. Pick it up. Pick it off. Use it. Put it back on. So it certainly is handy and very convenient. Keeps the ladders up off the ground. Easy tip, right? All right. But as I say, I made a mistake. When you do this, if you do this, when you do this, don't make the mistake I did. I'm a very straight line, dotted T's, dotted T's and crossed I's, right? No. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I, I like things just right. My poor wife, I love her. But anyway, she, I don't know how she puts up with me, but everything has to be just right for me. <clears throat> so when I put two brackets on the wall, I measure and make sure they're level, right? Anybody would do that. Anybody with brains would do that. Yeah? Don't do that. If you're going to use these brackets to store your extension ladders, don't make them level. Make one of them a couple or three inches lower. I didn't do that. And now it's a nuisance because it's a steel wall, you see here. So I had to put a piece of wood on the inside to screw into. <clears throat> it's a nuisance to change them. Now, I can do it, but it's a nuisance. So what I had to do, you see right here, this piece of two by four on its side. I had to put that piece of two by four on the top of one of the brackets. So that it raised a little bit. So the extension ladder's up at a bit of an angle. Yeah. Oh, why? <laughs> well, after two years of sitting here, now it's obvious to me, these ladders, these extension ladders, they're actually U-shaped brackets. They get filled with water, summer and winter. Not a really big deal, those not good for it to sit in there. In the wintertime, it will freeze and, and, and could harm it. But <clears throat> since we have these on the north side of our drive-in shed, that's the side that nobody sees. That's where all the junk is. If we don't have much junk, we keep it pretty neat. But it's stuff we don't want people to see. We're either hiding it from them or it's, it's not pretty. Then we put that on the north side. So these are on the north side. Guess what? It never gets sun. So the water sits in there all summer, all winter, all summer, all winter. And every one of my ladders has got a fungus growth, <laughs> a green fungus growth inside. I'm looking at it a little while ago. I'm saying, what, what's going on here? What's that green stuff? Water sitting there. So I put these two by fours in there. Maybe one day when I have a few minutes to spare, I will actually move the brackets up two or three inches. So now when you put the ladder on, it's a little bit of an angle. The water runs right out. No problem, bit of wind and it dries right up. I know it's kind of a silly little thing, but if you're gonna hang your ladders up and if these brackets seem like a good idea, good, just don't make them level or you'll have the same problem. Anyway, small tip, nice winter morning. Hope there's something in there for you. Talk to you again real soon. Alec Pierce at the ranch.